Once there was a boy, and the boy loved stars very much. So this is the story about that boy who loved stars very much. Every night he watched the stars from his window and wished he had one of his own. So he wanted one of his own. So we are going to read this book, How to Catch a Star. Can we catch a star? Hmm. I changed my glasses to read the book here. So, can we catch a star? We can try to jump up high to catch a star. But we can pretend, we can imagine that we are catching star. So let's read the story. So who wrote this book for us? Oliver Jeffers. Let's turn the page. So this is the first page. What do we see here? We see stars, right? In the sky. Look at here. This little boy under the sky. Once there was a boy and the boy loved stars very much. Let's turn the page. On this page, see a window here? Here is the boy looking at the sky. And on this page, look, do you see the stars? Here, you can see a couple of stars there. Every night, the boy watched the stars from his window. So this is his window. And wished he had one of his very own. So let's turn the page again. Here. On this page, the boy is out here. He dreamed how this star might be his friend. They would play hide and go sick and take long walks together. So that's what he was thinking about the star. If he has one of his own, they're going to play hide and seek and go for a walk. Look here, he's taking the stars. Like, he's taking the star for a walk like this. So let's turn the page again. So look at it. on this page. The boy decided he would try to catch a star. He thought, he thought that getting up early in the morning would be best because then the stars would be tired from being up in the sky all night. So the next day he set out at sunrise. So he woke up very early in the morning when the sun rises, right? But he couldn't see any star anywhere. He sat down and waited for one to appear. He wanted to see one in the sky, right? But it was early in the morning, right? Let's turn the page. On this page, look. The boy sitting under a tree and waiting for one to appear. He waited. He waited and he waited. And he waited. And what happened? Look, he's still waiting. And he ate his lunch. Look, he's 
eating his lunch. So, so he had been waiting for long. Let's turn the page. On this page, do you see? He is still waiting. And after lunch, he waited under a tree. Look here, sitting under a tree, waiting for the star to come out. And after dinner, oh, so he had been waiting till dinner. So he had his lunch, right? And then he had his dinner too. He was waiting that long. And after dinner, he waited some more. Oops. So still, he was waiting. And here, look on this page. What do we see? We see a star, right? And the boy, right? Waiting there. Finally, just before the sun was about to go away, he saw a star. So after sunset, you can see the star in the sky. So let's turn the page. On this page, what do we see? We see, we see a star here and the boy is here, right? The boy tried to jump up and grab it. So he jumped up and tried to grab it. But he couldn't jump high enough. So stars are way away from us, right? Up high in the sky. So even if we jump up high, it's hard to catch them, right? So on this page, look. let's see what is he going to do to catch the star. So very carefully, he climbed to the top of the tallest tree he could find. So he found, oh, so he found the tallest tree here, look. But the star was still way out of reach. Right? We see stars are way out of our reach. They are in the sky, way up high, right? So, so let's turn the page. Here on this page, looks like he's trying something else. He thought he might lasso the star with the life belt from his father's boat. So here, this is the lasso. Right? Belt. So lasso is a ring at the one end of the rope. And if you'd like to get something, you have to pull the other end of the rope. Like here, look. Then you can grab something in that look so here look he is taking his daddy's tube from his boat but it was much too heavy for him to carry because of this tube right this tube is very heavy so he couldn't carry it let's turn the page again so here he is in a rocket ship. Hmm. Rocket ship may work. Rocket ship goes to the space. So rocket ship can help him. Let's see what he is trying to do. He thought he could fly up in his space ship and just grab the star. Oops. But he's but his spaceship had hmm, run out of petrol. Last Tuesday, when he flew to the moon, he used all his petrol 
to run his spaceship to go to the moon. So he is little sad here, look, because now he cannot use his spaceship too. Let's turn the page again. Here on this page, look, he is just thinking to do something different. Perhaps he could get a seagull to help him fly up into the sky to reach his, his star. Hmm. So this is the seagull. Look, the seagull is sitting at the end of a jetty. But the only seagull he could find didn't want to help at all. Oopsie. So, it didn't work, right? Let's turn the page again. Here. He is still on the jetty. Look at his face. He is still sad. The boy thought he would never catch a star. Oh, oh, oh. Just then, he noticed something floating in the water. Hmm, here, look. It was the prettiest star he had ever seen. Just a baby star. Just a baby star. It must have fallen from the sky. On this page, look, he's trying to catch the star from the water now. He tried to fish the star out with his hands. With his hands. Here, he is trying. But he couldn't reach it. Mm. This dog, the jetty, is too high. His hands didn't reach there. Then he had an idea. Hmm. The star might wash up on the shore. So he thought the star might wash up on the shore. He ran back along the jetty to the beach. So let's turn the page here. So from the jetty, now he is on the Sure, waiting for the star. Then he waited and waited and waited and watched and waited. So on this page, look, he's running towards something, right? Let's see. And sure enough, the star washed up on the bright golden sand. Here is the Stir on the bright golden sand. So it came to the shore now, right? Let's turn the page again. Here, on this page, look. He's walking with his star. The boy had caught a star. A star of his very own. So now he's very happy. He has his own star now, right? How did he get that star? From the seashore, right? From the beach, golden beach. So it was a starfish in fact, right? Have you seen a starfish? Starfish looks like this. They live in the sea. This story was written by whom? Oliver Jeffers. Would you like to see him when he was a little boy? Look, he wrote this beautiful story for us. Story about a boy. That's how he had his own star. Hope you like the story. Bye-bye. Thank you.